Remember, so far we, I think we did a lot from accounting when they, we know how to do the accounting quickly. You know, all the things. Now we're dealing with the financial statements and everything. So, incomplete records accommodate everything that we did. It's just that they will give you information, they will leave other information. And you must know how to work to find that information. I can give you an example. Uh, what we just did, remember we just did the statement of changes in equity? The one that we just did. They can give you the figures at the end. And they leave the figures at the beginning. Can you see that? So it means you must know how to work from the end and find the figures at the beginning. Remember the statement that we just did? We had the balance at the beginning. We had the total comprehensive income. Remember that? They can leave the total comprehensive income as blank. They give you all the other information. You must know how to find it. So maybe it's the easiest thing that you can find, as long as you know what you're doing. So when they say incomplete, nothing hectic. Remember the statement of profit and loss? We start from the sales. We ended up with what? Profit for the year. They can give you other items, but somewhere they leave other items blank. You must have a way of finding them. That is called what? Incomplete records. But let me use an exercise to explain this better. So you can't say, okay, this section is very new. It's not new. It's all the sections can be asked in this way. That's why it's the last one. Because you must learn everything thereafter we end with what? Incomplete. Like that. I think you know, you expect things that must be required under that. They can give you all the info. They can even give you the balance brought down for this at the end. They can leave sales returns blank. You must know how to find it. You need a skill. Let's use this question. Question one. So your friend has a helpful outlet in a new trendy student area and has been training for the last two years. She has not kept complete accounting records Knowing that you are studying accounting, she asked you to help her as she wants to obtain bank loan to expand her business. Can you just write that first of Esther? Thank you very much. <laughs> <laughs> After conducting an investigation, you established the following because you know what's going on. Sorry, that came try doesn't matter. You need to understand better. Okay. Can you see where we've got list of balances? I think we're not surprised to see list of balances. Né? But some of the balances appear on the 1st of October 2014. And some of them appear on the 30th of September 2015. I think already I see my accounting period here. When did we start this period? And we ended when? Yes. So those are the balances at the beginning. Those are the balances at the end. Remember, we're just analyzing for now. Any question about that? Don't look at the account, it won't make sense now. It won't make any sense now. We really now, we just have to understand it. An analysis of business bank statement showed the following deposits and payments. Remember, on the bank statement, you see deposits and what? Payments. Like in your case, the deposit comes in the form of a salary. But there are many daily orders that go through. Okay, so for this business, again, they tell us that on the bank statement, we found the following. Deposits came from different sources. We got deposits, collections from debtors, debtors paid us, capital contributed, owners brought the capital to the business, additional loan from what? Grandmother. Grandmother decided to give us a loan. So, obviously, we are seeing them on what? The bank statement. Additional information. They say the interest should be paid on the loan from her grandmother. The rate is 8% per annum. The additional amount was received on the 1st of April. Remember, guys, they can give you whatever information. It doesn't mean that you must record all the information. I think you know by now. You are controlled by the requirement. So, already on number one, I don't see anything that is affecting debtors. Can you see now? 
Okay, don't worry, we're just reading. Discount of 850 has been allowed to debtors, and 1,500 discount has been received from creditors. The credit losses of 352 had to be written off. That's where your account equation must come into play here. The inventory to the value of 245 had been returned to the creditors. An inventory with the selling price of 4388 has been returned by the customers. Again, account equation must be there. Okay, yes, girls. Depreciations of 15,086 should still be provided for the depreciable debt. It's okay, that's the information. But what they want me to do, they say I must prepare the debtors and the creditors what? Control. So our first start with what? Just control. Can you see there's nothing new here? It's just that the way they give you the information will be a little bit different. That's why I say we need our account equation skills. What is what is this to us? Classify for me. What is it? Asset. Increase what? And decrease what? So we still need this. We still need this. Nothing new. We've got a score mark. So please stop me if it doesn't make sense. This is called a general ledger account. What is the first thing that we need to record under the debtors control? Balance. Balance. Under which side must I put the balance of debtors? So the year I think we started on there. I think it's October, right? The first. And we say balance brought down. Be careful. They gave us the list of balances, but we only need the balance of debtors, which is under the first of what? October. Let's go and check how much. Just something. Debtors control. You know what? The balance at the beginning is given. One to nine. Thank you very much. Please, everyone, make sure that you take the correct one. Be careful, guys. They gave you two balances. Can you see now? So you must be careful. The balance is beginning, so the balance at the end. Check the way at the beginning. At the beginning, the balance at the beginning is what you do when you open an account. You always put the balance at the beginning. Yes, we started there. So if we started on the 30th of September, is it September or November? The end period. So if I can put it there, it means I'm ending. Am I ending now? No, this is the beginning of the period I started with this balance. Don't add the true amount and divide by two. Why? Try to be fair. Uh -uh. Take the one that you need. That's why I say the skills, you still need those skills. Because now they're giving you two. There are people, I know them. So, are we, are we doing the business control accounts in the year which end or which year are we doing the business control accounts? So, what is our year according to the information? That is the beginning? Yeah. Yeah, that is the, the September is the end period. So we're dealing with we're in that year. So here we're at the beginning of that year. We still want to end. We can only end when we balance at the end. Okay. <coughs> can be a month, but here we're dealing with what? I continue. Now let's go to the information. Because from the list of balances, I don't think that we need anything, but we only found what that is. Okay. Let's switch over to the table there. On the next page, guys. Can you see where we talked about the bank statement? There's a table there. Is there any information that affect debtors according to you? Mm -hmm. Which one? Yes. Debtors gave us cash. The question is, if the debtors are giving you cash, Will the first control increase or decrease? On the website. Thank you. But this is um this is cash set and cash sales. The challenge is. So that has to be the one that we find the end. No, no. Here they gave us. Is the cash we received from one? Then debtors. Doesn't make sense. No, but it says here. Collections from debtors 
and catch sight. Yes. Can you see here the promise? Here they are trying to, at the end we need the cash that we receive. So whether it's cash or letters, it doesn't matter. So at the end we just need to know the cash that we, we receive. I understand where they wrote what? Cash sales. Normally if they separate, I can understand. So maybe say something, maybe. Oh, hold on. Mm. What are we trying to find here? We don't know yet. Because, no, because we already have the balance. Yes. Bought down. Yes. We even have the balance carried down. Yes. Okay? Mm -hmm. So at some point we have to find, and the odds are likely that it would be the cash from the debtors. Because here it says collections from debtors and cash sales. But cash sales can't fall under debtors because a cash sale is not a transaction between a debtor. Yes. But, that's why I've seen this before. I, I get your point. Maybe the fact that maybe they mentioned that cash sales. Well, that, uh, that was brand new. Yes, and I understand you. That's kind of. But at the moment, when we're speaking, we don't know what we are trying to find. So at the end, when we have all the information, we're gonna realize this account is not balancing according to the information given to us. Something is missing. Can you see now? So it will depend at the end of the day. So I think, please, I think you raised a good point here. Please, where you see that cash sales, just scratch that thing. Just say cash from the system. Because normally when they do that, they must separate the cash from what? From debtors. Well, uh, I think that's what we might be trying to find out. Try to find? That's fine. We'll, 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 uh, let's, let's wait until we see it. Are we okay? So, meaning, I need to go and record that amount. How much is it? Uh, 150381. Under which size? Under the credit side. What is the date of the year? Thirtieth uh, of September, twenty fifteen. September. Please scratch that case there. I think you put a point. This was a previous paper. Okay. So what is the contra here? One last thing before yeah. the amount. Bank. Which book do we normally use? CBR. CBR. How much is it? One five zero. Uh huh. One. One. Thank you. Okay. So this is the cash we receive from the others. Now let's record. Let's go to the next one. Which other information do you think will affect us? On that table, we put the contribution, capital. No. Discounts of interest. Okay, well, there are the information there. We put discount of what? 850. Where will I put it? Credit. No, no. Credit. 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 So, what is the contract? Discount? Oh. Remember the new developments? We don't have to use the discount grant of sales instead. But in brackets, you can write what? Discount grant. Okay. And which book do you normally use for the discount? General Jenna, and how much is it? Said 850. Mm -hmm. Are we okay? Mm. Next. Of how much? 3.52. Okay, let's put the credit losses. Do run credit loss or bad debt? Let's use credit losses. Which Jenna? Yeah. How much? Three five. Thank you. Next. Yes. Yes. Customers under which side? Credit. What is the contract? Which channel? Credit allowance. Yeah. 
collected G A G. Okay. How much did you learn? Um, it is one thousand four hundred and thirty-eight. Four three eight. Thank you, guys. What else do we have? Nothing. When we did the business from sorry, can you clean a four percent account where we had to separate the part for nine? So this is our perfect commitment. This is just a straight up. Yes. So like now it says here it was with the same question. Just put it all together or we have to cut it all for No no. Here we need selling practice because it's what we saw for yeah. every day. That was thing was to account to Queen and similar with the drawings where we had to calculate cost of sales for drawings or where they give us the dinners where we have to separate cost of sales and sale funds. If we if we if we had training stock that we gave the selling price. So we said this training stock at the selling price of a thousand rand mm -hmm. had to be returned back to the creditors. Mm -hmm. Then we have to take the selling price off. Yes. But this stock has gone out, we bought a pair of jeans from a shop, you have to take it back and you have to be refunded a hundred rand or whatever it was. That's the selling price. So that's the selling price. So the selling price that it is Casper by the side by the time when we sold to him, we sold to him for money. So when he returns, we cannot only record cost of sales. So we need to reverse the whole selling price. Don't confuse that is when we were dealing with the subsidiary amounts where we had call up for cost of sales and call up for sale. And even under account equation, remember where we used to have four accounts. So don't confuse the two. So here we always have what? Selling price. Okay, can we continue? So if you can check we don't have any other information. The only thing that we can do here is to balance this account. Mm -hmm. Let's draw this. Please make sure you leave one space here. One is probably here we have a lot of space. Because we're not sure whether we're going to come here on that side. Okay. So I'm going to have this. But before we can balance, check here. These are incomplete records. Normally we must find, remember when we balance, we say balance carry down, balance brought down. In this exercise, already they gave us that balance brought down. Go back to the list of balances and give me the balance brought down. On six eyes. Yes? Four six five. Is it on there? Where will I have a contact? Credit sign. Guess what? Balance. Balance? Carry down. Yeah. I think the balance came down. Of how much? <coughs> One? Uh, six eyes. Four six five. Four six five. And normally this must be called brought down. Normally you are the one who must find this. Now they give it to you. So the brought down is the same. If you check, what is the date here? The first of October. Balance. Brought down. How much is it? Guys, normally you are the one who must find this. But I think this question they gave it to you already. This is the challenge. Because these are incomplete. That's what I was going to we, we still want to balance it. So now let's go and check. Which side is the biggest? Okay, don't why don't why check it. Why are we doing the balance carry down on the credit card? They gave it to us. It's brought down here. It's must go on the debit side. But normally when we balance it, it must come here. We're just following the position. Okay. As long as you put a brought down here, it must come as a carry down. Same amount. Same amount. Just like you of the way. Yes. So now, which side is the biggest? Please don't check this one. This one is outside, is it? You only check from here up there. Which side is the biggest? Yes. One is the total. You must also include this one. Three, three, four, four, three, six. Four, three, six. Thank you. Three, two, four, four, three, six. But this doesn't balance, there's a difference. So I say this minus it. Sales. Yes. It is not. That will be the sales. Normally we put sales here. It means sales are missing. So I'm gonna say two thousand three. Yo, you were fired. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> sales. Thank you. Sales. 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 Sales.
Can you see the importance of knowing this first? Otherwise, how will you know that it's there? I don't know it's there. It makes sense. It's so simple to actually. But I do it. They made a blunder with that case. Scratch it. Otherwise, it will look otherwise. This is our data system. Wow. That's just a quick thing. And now we say, what thing? The signal in general. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> How much? Two four. Two four. Maybe. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Okay. Next. Additional loan. Yes. Uh, loan is a liability, but a standalone account. Okay. Yeah. And the same thing with the interest on payable, loan payable. Yeah. Something secret. Why? Unless if you go to the financial statements under the notes, yeah. creditors will absorb the accrued authority yes. then. Hospital. <laughs> <laughs> it's a lesson. It's a lesson. Yeah. It's can can I can I give you something? Eh? Let's say we're having a business you know. We go to after we ask for a loan. What are the two accounts? Bank. Bank and loan. loan. Unless if we were buying loans, it would make sense. Yeah, we're not buying trading stock. Well, yes, yeah, yeah. so we're not buying trading stock. So if we were buying loans, yes, I should say yes, credit stock. Yes, they are both liabilities, but they are standalone accounts and liabilities. Okay. Okay, you said discount and now we said? Yes. 2015, eh? Yeah, I It's okay. And then, what was the rest? This one is it. What do you mean about it now? It's still like a fiscal test. <laughs> Let's do the opposite. We know we don't normally have that. Né? So remember we talked about the discount granted now sales. So discount received. What is the opposite of sales? Thanks. Just something that changed, guys. Yeah. So for discount so just say, but this one, I know. But they're still trying to, you know, transition. Still, no, transition. Just it's okay. Oh. It's see, not going to General, please. Okay. How much? Okay. One thousand. Mm-hmm. Thank you very much, guys. Remember, this was the previous paper before the changes. Yeah. Don't feel bad. So. Next. Hmm? Where? Where is this return? Jenna? C A J. How much? Then G U. So that in the balance side one. <laughs> and then? But this one I give it to you if you wrote this card. I'm going to count it. I'm going to offer. Okay, granting you. Yeah. Is that all? Balance? Sure. This is a boring exercise. Must do this, eh? Mm-hmm. Because, oh, balance where? Yeah. Here. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Balance? Mm-hmm. How much? Seven. One, one. No. Seven? Only one. Only one, one. <laughs> <laughs> and then I must bring it down here. Yes. Approval. Well, eh? How much? Same. 
Alright, stay. <laughs> uh, and then? In being balanced. Did you say this way? Yeah. Okay. 26 one by one. 26. Mm -hmm. Like that? Mm -hmm. Chunk 6, one by one. See, I don't know what I'm doing anymore. <laughs> Just try. I'm okay. Mm -hmm. But obviously, I must have this. Yeah. Huh. Just remember this like I'm used to it. But not places, we know what it is. Remember? Or oh, total places is up to you. Total? Otherwise, it's going to look like this. It's not the same thing. This says that is not the same thing, man. This means various places. This means straining stop. Okay. China? No, How much? But I think you found the difference. Yeah, one four two six. One four two? Mm -hmm. I'm telling you, in most cases, I'm going to show you the other questions which are a little bit deeper. Then. They normally ask for this now. And that side of letters they ask for six. But the information can come in a different way. So I don't want you to memorize the format. Just know what you're looking for. I'm going to bring the other one. The other one, that we, did we do the incomplete one inside? Yeah. Yes, that one is different. Eh? But same thing. We have to find the same thing. And you can even find it without a cup. By doing the same thing. Yeah, that one was different from this one. Same thing. That's why I was so scared. I feel like I didn't do this. That one was easy, actually. This was easy, but not if I would say people were going to run. Because I would have done the lines. That's true. No, but so you see the other one, it's so easy. It's basically like a statement, so you can actually see. So, what we need to do is to check the list of balances. Only focus on year 2015. And it's advisable for us to use accounting equation as our technique. Okay, what is accounting equation? Yes. What is accounting equation? Tell me. Assets. So, meaning, owner's equity is equal to assets minus <coughs> liabilities. You agree with me? Yeah. So if you can group your assets together, group your liabilities together, the difference is your answer. Are we together? Let's quickly do that. I don't know if you can do that on your own. Let me test you for two minutes. Use 2015. Group your assets together, add them together. Group your liabilities together. Now, the difference will be the answer, will be the owner's equity. Or Kevin. Two minutes. Equity. If you can check, this information is from Solfida, by the look of things. So, as long as we know what to do. So, what's the formula for, for this? What's the first thing that we need to put? Balance. Balance. As as do you know where we began with this keywords? Professor, the first one is off something. This yes. is like uh well, this one. Mm -hmm. So in the exam, can you just give them that answer? Yes, please yes. Yeah, but if you want to you want to write all down to zero dollars. these marks. So if you if you add by ten, oh. you write something wrong with the two. Or let's say four here instead of five. Yeah. 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 But you can. <laughs> you can't do so very much. You can. You still get ten marks. You still have time. That's right. Uh, you know what you do? You write A, and then you write the list of five things for them. Then you write L, and then you write the list of those things. Yeah. Just, just in case. No, because then if you get the answer wrong, but all those other things right. You just get nine marks. You get nine out of ten. Yeah. That's good enough. Trust me, you don't want to do that, so you use ten marks. Okay, please, I want the balance, please. Two, two, two. 
three, four, three, five. Two, 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 four, three. Five. It's the one that you just calculated, okay? It's balance at the beginning. Okay. The question is, do we have any additional contribution? Yes. Remember the additional information, the contribution normally from the information. How much was the additional? Three eight, three hundred. Uh, three eight, three hundred. Three eight, three hundred. Guys, are you all following? So quiet, I don't know what that means. Okay. Do we have any profit for the year? Let's call it the way they call it now. Total comprehensive income for the year. Do we have any? Check the information. Either they give it to you or they don't give it to you. So we must just check. No, I think we have to work that out since can't have the profits. Yes, can you see? <coughs> we don't have it, we have to skip this one, okay? What is the next thing that you normally do? Drawings. We must less drawings. Do we have drawings? Uh, yes. How much? Four thousand. Just for control, put. Then normally here, I think you can see the reason why it comes the record is the last section. Because these things are not new. Whether you agree with me or not, but are you okay? And then I'm going to write balance S at 30th of September. 2016. This is what we have. Or you just say balance at the end. Is it given? No. Okay, let's find it. How can we find it? We do have figures there. But we can. Can you see we can't? Why? Because if you can check the information under 2016, some of the things are not there. Like what? So, meaning for now, we need to leave this question like this because we know that this statement is related to the other statement. Normally, the amount that you put here is transferred to the statement of financial position. So, we must go to the statement of financial position and try to find out. If we can find this first, thereafter we'll come back and paste it. At the moment, there's nothing we can do. That is the disadvantage of having one incomplete record. So there's nothing we can do at the moment. So and we, we have for two spaces, and we cannot <coughs> find two spaces at the same time. We must at least have one of them. If I can have this one, I can be able to find this one. If I can have this one, now it's proven that I don't have this one. I don't have this one. Let's go to the next requirement. What about yes. incomplete record probably cover what? 60 marks out of 180 in the exam? No, not a lot. Because, I mean, it shows you have to work, you have to do it. <laughs> Normally, not 60, but let me just say 15%, 20%. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Like here, can you see just like here? What it like it's a comprehensive question, but normally they have for this short question. You'll see by the same when you do revision, they try to make it short, but still qualifies to be what you call it. But if they give you something like this and the other one, right, it means there must be used marks for the other one. Yeah, yes, it depends. Yeah, exactly. So now we have to go and open the statement of. Can I quickly erase this because I want to have this? But you must have this so that when we come, we just copy and paste. I'm going to throw this again. Remember, it's not all about finishing, it's all about understanding. Okay. What 
the first thing we write? Let's add it. And we have this is okay. It's the layout. And then what do we have as the first thing here? I'm gonna use abbreviation for that. PPE stands for property plant and so we need to go ahead and check if we have those things. Okay, let's go and check if we've got any property planning equipment. Any one of those? Yeah. What do we have? How much is the cost? Participation is compulsory. 1368. Another 8. That's the balance. Don't you have any accumulated depreciation? I don't mention anything. Okay, go to the information, please. Does that depreciation on the sheet? I have one. We do have it. How much is it? Must I add or less? Okay. Remember, we need anything depreciation related, please. What else? Is that all? Even on the information, do we have something? Yes. So I see here that they showed some machinery. When? That updated. That we have updated. Yes, it does. So do we have to subtract it as well? Yes, we need to. We need to. Yes. We need to. We need to. Uh, that question says depreciation of machinery. Non -director. and on vehicles. What is written all? Yeah. There, which one number? Number seven. They say depreciation was written all. Yeah, meaning is the depreciation for the year. It has been calculated. Like they are trying to say that oh, it, it, it must be we need to take it off. Okay. Oh, okay. So okay, let's can you tell me the easiest thing is to start with the balances mm. and thereafter go to the information. Okay. So we do have one three six eight, I agree, no? We should have added 72990. Okay. Wait, okay. I'm gonna add even though I think you will understand. Okay, thank you. Very much. Do you have to actually like do that? Why can't we like say why don't we like this is what I would do? Mm -hmm. I'll write land client assets and the ETE and my machinery and calculate the in brackets and then obviously check the photos into the corner. No, 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 you're not allowed to show them here. This accommodates, that's why they said no code PD. Okay. So everything um, must be done there. Okay. Okay. Yes. So plus, give me that. 7290. Okay. Let's try to finish everything on the, on the balances. That's all, then. Yeah. Let's go to the information. Uh, we start with which one? 45,000. Yeah. Yes, we need to add how much? 45 because we bought plus 45,000. You can even put it aside if you have more space when you write exam. If you don't want your statement to look you know, too much information, the more you do that, the more more space. And then what else must we add for less machinery? How much? 46. The one that is sold. Minus. Four, six. What else do we have? Uh, How much? Five four seven zero. Five four seven zero minus five four seven zero. What else? Okay. Close brackets and find the two. Five nine zero. I'll wait for what is it? 
Two, three, five, oh, two, 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 one. Oh. <laughs> two and five. Two and five. We've got one, three, six, eight, eight here. Plus seven, two, nine, nine here. Yeah. Plus forty-five thousand here. Yeah. Minus nine, five, eight here. Yeah. Minus four, four, uh, four, six here. Yeah. And then minus uh, four, four, five, four, seven here. Yeah. Two, three, four, two, two, zero. Yeah. I've got one, seven, two, three, five. You know what's nice about the way guys? This always matters. Yeah. <laughs> because uh, we have a problem and loss and we have to create ourselves. Yeah, yes. <laughs> I like this one. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, everyone must celebrate. <laughs> 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 but it's okay. <laughs> okay, can we are you okay? <laughs> guys, here yeah, I think this is correct. You found it twice, I mean, yeah, yeah. and then you can wait and do it. Yeah, so you can say the same one. You can do it. Yeah. Okay. Normally, after PPT, what do you normally put in? No, I can't. Like, no, I can't. No, no, it's uh, the longer that it's put. It is uh, probably not known. No, I'm just saying, still have an uncurrent asset. We normally have PPT, and what else makes it? Uh, Financial assets. Meaning investments, fixed deposit, you know, things like that. But check, I don't think the report fixed deposit here, any investment in shares? No. I think I made a mistake here. This was supposed to come in, mm -hmm. and I had that, okay? So I'm going to say 2352 trading, and this one must be here as, yes. and then, yeah, that's what we're supposed to do, not share. And I'm gonna underline here to show that that is the only one. In future, I can have more than one, okay? For that. <laughs> Current assets. You and I know better. What is the first one that you need to put? Inventory. Inventory. And then remember, you need to know what cons what does the con invention consist of, okay? So if you check here, let's go back to the information. Do you have any invention from the list? Mm -hmm. Of how much? So I think the four five zero. Yes. That the one at the end. Yes. Mm, what else do you expect to add on the invention? Remember the rules. Inventory consists of inventory on hand, like the one we gave me. And any consumable stuff on hand. Any PPT material on hand, stationary on hand was supposed to be added here. But it seems as if we only have that. Okay? How much? 83450. Guys, I think you all see that. Go and check the invention. This is at the end of the period. End of the period. Because they gave you two, yeah? Don't check the one at the beginning. Are we okay? Let's check the next item. Before that, let's put the trade and other. The syllables, no? Would you not um, just do it in order? Yeah, but the penny cash, no, not according to, like, according to, if you mix them, there's no problem. But even if you say penny cash, don't write it on, your, on its own. It's cut off cash and cash equivalent. Uh -huh. Yes. Um, I think this is the same as that as you remember. Yeah. Yeah. And you must know what does it consist of. Do you have any letters at the end? Or train other receivables? Yes. Mm -hmm. How much is it? Five, eight, two, one, one. Any other information? I could income, prepaid expenses. Any rent deposits? Nothing, man. Give it to me again. Uh, five, eight, two, one, one. Thank you. I think you when you found this will find it, okay. That's why this is incomplete. There's not a lot of information. Unlike the section itself, what we do with this. Remember, you have to find many things. Allowances for trade notes. Allowances for settlement is coming Oh, you have to go back, man. No problem. I can't remember that. <laughs> okay, Eric, now I'm going to come to what you have suggested before. Cash and cash equivalent. And we know what does this consist of. Petty cash, as you mentioned, bank, things like that. Let's go and check them. What do we find? So I can use the bank statement. Okay, the bank statement. Let's go and check. Bank statement. 
Tu es bien comme tu es maintenant. Ok, yes, ok. Uh, we have got uh, how much? Which amount was I use? The balance was how much? Two, six, eight. Two, six, I'm gonna put this in brackets. Two, six, eight. Two, six, five, eight. Okay, uh, Number? This, that is the balance on the bank statement, the balance that we have, positive balance. Can you see that? Number? But we still have to deduct a check they gave us there. Of how much do we the check? And we also have a deposit. Meaning this they did not minus this over there. Yeah, they should have taken it, but now they still have to take it out. No, this one is it a check or a deposit? Check. So checks are payments. So do we have any deposit there? Oh, okay. And yeah. the one one one. Okay. Plus two four one nine. Somehow I thought a check was given to us. Yeah. Oh yeah. No man, remember even under bank reconciliation section, when they talk about checks, it means prepaid. Yeah. Unless if they say you receive the check. Okay. Uh remember we need to check again. Apart from that, do you have any other thing that can affect our cash? Pay cash. Pay cash of how much? Two two. Two two. Okay. Plus or minus? Thank you very much for that. And then you can use your calculator. And I trust you with the calculator. Just while we're talking about the you said that you must read the balances that they have with the period. Yes. So then to the financial position, they will make it clear. Mm -hmm. But when you calculate the amount, actually, the amount at the end of the period, although we have information in that, it's going to be like the same answer. Shouldn't we calculate it first and then use that answer to, to, to calculate that? Come again. Which one? That is the asset that you have. You cannot ignore it. You had it from the previous year. Oh. You're still having it. Just that you've lost your value now. You have got the new value. Uh, I'm not telling you something. So, telling you something. You had it from the previous year. Yes. You sold the whole bunch. And, you, and then, if your building burnt down on that last day, how much trade stock would you have? What vehicle would you have but at then, that point? Because if you cost so much, right? Yeah. It means you have to find the value of Let's stop there when you put the question mark. It's because those are depreciable assets. You must first depreciate them to get the new thing. Yes. But you eventually have to depreciate. Yeah, I get it. Yes. Then I understand. So I'm saying if you put that depreciation in the table and work it out, and when you're doing your PPP because you already have depreciated from the information that they give you here, while you're doing your statement of financial position, can you just not put those new products because that's what it is? No, those are the values from the previous year. This year they lost the value again. So you take the values from the previous year minus the current lost values. How much is the real value now? Okay, but I think maybe she's asking that. Is she allowed to, in the, are we allowed to make them write notes ourselves? Because the, that's what you're actually saying here. You still, so you can actually say notes because all of that writing to put in here. Oh, okay, you well, have done a balance. This? And oh. you, you could have put all I that together. She's saying it could. So it could have been two different things, right? Mm -hmm. Machinery is one piece of paper. Yes. Yes. From the previous year. From the previous year. Right? Yes. If you look at uh, debtors. Yeah. If you look, we took the figure from 2015 for debtors and we didn't take the mm -hmm. figure from 2016. No. no we, we, we took the figure from 2016, yes. but not 2015. 
So why are we choosing to take figures from 2014 in some instances and 2016 in some instances? Our year is 2016. So if they give us figures for 2016, it means we are covered. But, but if you think of the 2016 for okay. machinery, that's the machinery we make for the UK. Yeah, can you see for machinery, there's reason why they put question mark. If they give us something under 2016, that's what I'm saying. Let me tell you something. Assets minus, well, the, the uh, not, not assets. So, due to the value in the beginning minus depreciation in the year. So, that is the that is the total value. It's what we did here. That is what we did. Yes, but that's what I'm saying. Yeah. Well, okay, so what's the question? What you oh. The question is. Do we have to put it all there? Like you, you calculate it. Because I'm thinking in my head, that's a lot of information. So I'm thinking if I'm reading the question, machinery is carrying value 2015. I get it. Then I read the additional information. Oh, the carrying value of all this was deducted. And then I put that as a new value. And then when I do my notes here, instead of using my minus, 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 can I just look, use the difference that I have and then have, and actually calculate what I need to calculate? The question is, will you get the same answer with me? Like well, I said, I don't know, remember I said this is risky. Yes. If, it show, if you can show me this, even without the calculator, it's okay. But what if you write 2352? Two? It doesn't matter how you show the calculation. Remember, I even said you can do it aside. Instead of putting information here, you can do everything aside, bring that, answer it. Okay. So if the answer is perfect, let's say it's five months, I'll give you five months without calculation. But if it's wrong, and I can't see those calculations somewhere, you lose all five months. So, uh, so I still can like, calculate it in the way that I understand. Yes, don't have to put it here. But, but have That's a notice in the file, if you have notes attached to it, to say this is how I got that. Yes. But if you don't write any of that, you will lose all those marks. Mm -hmm. I, I'll probably write it because, uh, like in my head, how I would work it is like I've got machinery for 136880, and then it says here that there was depreciation during the year. Mm -hmm. So I'll calculate that on the side, and then I'll have the total on the list. For that year? Yes. It's okay. The 10 year. Meaning my calculations are going to be short. But the pencil will be. The same. That one is acceptable. I thought you were questioning them, why are we not taking the figures from, you know, I didn't understand you at first, but now I get you. Okay. Can, I, can I say something? Yeah. As long as the answers are the same, don't worry about how you find. <laughs> Even if you look at the same, we'll get the answers. Okay, <laughs> what about this one? <laughs> um, okay. okay. Do we still have anything? No. So let's add current answers, please. One seven one two two four. Okay. Now we can do the answer. Two two four answers. Four six triple four. Four. Four six triple four. Four or six? Four or six. Yeah. Okay. Now, the next section is equation liabilities. And what? The first thing we write there is what? Ownership. But we don't have it. We need to skip it. This is in common. So from ownership, what where do we normally go? Non current liabilities. Do you have any non current liabilities? Yes. yes. Any conditions about the loan? Short term must go under current. Let's check. How much is your loan? Any question about maybe the repayment of the loan, something like that? We pay how much? Okay, we need to minus it. Okay. So this is called, you know what? We call it long term borrowing, remember? Or interest bearing borrowing. Let me use it long term. 
loan or borrowing. Let me use the word borrowing. Again, here, guys, it's actually just show me the calculation. It says 73,000 minus thank you. How much? Okay, because this will pay. Okay. Will I be in short term loan? Not a short term loan. Okay. We must look for the trade in other payables. Let's go and find them. Same as the creditors. We have them. 40? 40. This one, we don't have any, we can just underline this one. Because we don't have any receipt to this. So, with regards to owner's deposit. Do we just leave it like that? Yeah, because we don't need it. That's what we're going to find out. But doesn't the cell say it's the number one? It's no, blank. It's blank. It's blank. Go and check. It's blank. Oh, that's the one that we're looking for. Yeah. Okay. Okay. And so that was the only equity of 2015. Mm -hmm. Okay, is there any question so far? I know space is a challenge now. And I just say one. Yeah, it's on. <laughs> and then total equity and liabilities? We don't know. So, this we cannot add because we don't know. No, we are missing what? This one. Remember, we are missing this one. We just have to copy what we have here because it must be done. So take this and copy it there as a total of equity and liabilities. Because it must balance automatically. So we put 4 0 total 4. And this will help us to find what is missing there. Because whatever you put here, when you add 63, when you add 40 here, you must get there. Mm -hmm. So this amount minus this 2, that will be the amount that I'm looking for. 302. 960. 960. Balance. So, this, go and copy it on the statement that we just opened, the statement of change and equity. The last, you know, always said the balance at the end, the last amount there is blank. Go and copy this amount there. Statement of change and equity. Go back to it. The last amount is blank. If that one, the red amount must be uh, put there. Did you put it? No. Call me if you are, so that I can show you. Oh. Yes. Now you can find this one. How can you find this one? Uh, this plus this, you do the opposite. This plus this minus the rest. Did you write it? Change in liquid. This is the yes. yeah. See this one? Yes. You write it? Yeah. And you work here. Yeah. This plus this minus the rest. Yeah. Did you miss something? Yeah. Yeah, it's correct. But you don't have this, you need to do a little bit. How do you find it? Why you didn't write this one? Thing oh, this is the first thing we have. Because we're looking for that now. So what? Um, did you put it? Let's see. Did you put it there? Where's your balance? At the end. So I did that title, so what was that? You, know? you put this, you copy this. This is the one that must go in the statement, which is the last. Throw. I'm not there. So the balance balances it. And then you take it into the system. Did you copy that? Yes. So that I can show you. Who's your statement? 
So you take that. You copy it here. So now find this one. You take this, do the opposite. You add, you let it. Because you're waiting back. You see? You put it there. Take it, take it. Yeah. You put it there. Now you can find it. Do the opposite by going down. In oh, bracket to add, without bracket to let. The difference will be. So now if we remember assets, why do you want to draw them again? Because no, no, you're waiting back. Yeah. You're waiting back. So we're going to add. Yeah. 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 Oh, Otherwise, that's all. Now that's all for all this. But for now, for the money, for the money. Okay, fine. Okay. I'm just worried about the stuff that we did at Bank Recon. Yeah. 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 And to double check it, if you check this and you add all this, then I have a master that will end up checking this square. Yeah, yeah. Just add again, let's see. We're all equally wrong. Six, uh, uh, four, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty-one, twenty-two, twenty-three, twenty-four, twenty-five, twenty-six, twenty-seven, twenty-eight, twenty-nine, twenty-ten, twenty-eleven, twenty-twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty-one, twenty-two, twenty-three, twenty-four, twenty-five, twenty-six, twenty-seven, Okay, yeah, yeah. Uh, the was the same of the change in the as well. Um, and then we would make it from there. Yeah. Yeah. So, yeah. so basically, this here is actually like the first question. So it's the first question. Not bad. It's the first question for so like that. Yeah. Yes, for the. So, so now we have to do it. We can. 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 Maybe some of things will be given to you. But you know, I want us to be ready for everything. But if they decide to give more to this section, this is. Because they get A, they answer, but we.